You know how one of the worst things we have to do up here in New England is shovel snow? Well, you're gonna love this next project. We're gonna actually install a heated walkway. It's a concrete brick paver, but we're gonna install this new heating system underneath. The minute the snow starts to fly, hits the sensor, heat comes on, boom, snow's gonna get melted away. I got my two friends, Annie and Dave here. They're gonna help me install it. They're out there getting ready. Let's go see what's happening. Hey, Arnie, how we doing? Hey, Hank, how's it going today? Not bad, and yourself? Fantastic. This is Arnie Arsenault. He's with Arsenault and Sun Landscape. He's here to help us do our project today. And looking forward to it. Look, looking good. I see you got Dave working hard oh, over Dave there. Working hard as always. So what have we got done so far? Right now we've already uh, started with the cutoff, cutting out the asphalt so that we can put in uh, the pavers. Okay. I know that this is a different kind of project than you typically do. First thing is, it's got to be the smallest patio you've ever installed, it is. isn't this it? Is, this is a great size patio for us. I'll bet you Dave's loving <laughs> Dave this. Is huh? loving is this that right, size. Dave? Yeah, I'm sure you do. But in other ways, there's something different that you're going to be doing today. What's the first thing? The first thing we're doing different today is called the paver-based product. Okay. And that's going to help uh, replace some of the gravel that we use. How does it replace the gravel? Well, what ends up happening is we normally use uh, excavate down another six inches above what we've already done. Okay. And so we've eliminated that process. You don't have to dig that down. No, we don't have to dig that down. Okay, so that saved Dave a lot of backache. A lot of okay. backache work. So I see he's putting some gravel in now. Yes, he is. What are, what are you trying to do with this what gravel? What we want to do is we want to use at least a couple of inches of gravel to get the, the level down Okay. before we start to work to the next part. All right, so now you've got your gravel down. What would you do next? The next part, then we're going to actually add uh, about a, an inch of sand, okay. three quarters of an inch to an inch of sand, and that's going to help level the area so that we can lay the paver base on a level surface. All right, and the paver base does what? I mean, what is its really job other than just eliminating? It's going to give you a flat surface, isn't it? It gives you a flat surface, uh, right. but the, the big key is also the elimination of the extra work that we would have had that to do. That you would have had to do yep. to get it up there. Absolutely. Okay. Once you've got that down, now it comes the next big... Yep. Uh, I'm excited about this product. What is it you're going to install next, Arnie? Uh, we're going to, on this project today, we're actually going to be installing a product called ProMelt. ProMelt? Yes. And that, that melts snow, it right? It melts snow, and here in New England, we need that. So you're going to install what? A mat, a cable, uh, a rug? What? What? Today we're going to use the cable. They're, they come in both mat and a cable, but today yep. we're going to use the cable due to the size of the project. Okay. And after you put the cable in, what turns it on and off? I mean, do I have to go out and flick the switch? No, there's actually a sensor that's going to be really? located out in the elements. Okay. And so once it starts to snow, the yep. snow will actually turn the unit on. All right. So we've got all of those parts here. Now we get that in. Yes. Right. What's left? Uh, then we end up putting the pavers down. Okay, putting the pavers down. We are, I know we had talked about putting the polymeric sand in, but yep. that's a problem today? Yeah, no, normally once we get done the pavers, we actually put a, po uh, a product called polymeric sand, yep. and that would help seal all the voids. All right, why can't we do that today? Uh, today we actually had some rain that actually made our product, uh, our pavers wet, and so it's hard okay. for us to use that product. So yeah, the last thing we want to do is put that sand on a wet paver. It's going to kind of yeah. gum all up on us. Up. All right. You need to have dry conditions. So that's one last thing Dave has to do, one huh? One last thing, and I think he's happy Is that, is that okay, Dave? All right, this is, this is working out great. Yep. All right, so we're almost ready with the gravel. Yes. Let's get started on the rest of our project. All right. All right. Sounds great. 